Hello people, welcome to the United Way. Harry Maguire will be a Manchester United player. Very uh, strange uh, update, but you know, I mean, we have been talking on this channel about Manchester United agreeing a fee with Harry Maguire. We have been talking about Harry Maguire also being happy and uh, to move for a new challenge uh, that is West Ham United. But uh, for the past 24 hours, we have some com confirmation from most uh sports journalists this is david onstein writing here that harry maguire <clears throat> harry maguire will be joining west ham okay will not be joining us i'm sorry uh i said Mary, harry maguire will not be joining uh, west ham that's from david onstein saying that so uh, i mean i've had this information like 24 hours ago the reason i didn't go out the video is simple because i think it was uh, it was a scam but uh, when you get people like David Onstein coming out and saying Harry Maguire we need to stay in Manchester United I will, uh, I will not believe in Manchester United it, it, it turns my stomach to be honest because this is uh, we were thinking we're starting on a very new uh, new uh, chapter of Manchester United but when you see a major a major um, uh, disappointment like like this you start getting worried so guys yes before we'll talk about that we'll talk also about Mason Greenwood I will emphasize what what the direction in which Mason Greenwood's situation is going because it's becoming a joke, uh, it's becoming very unprofessional, and I think uh, we have to call it out in this channel. If there is no channel talking about it, I think we need to talk about mm -hmm. it. So uh, <clears throat> the situation here, we let's go start straight straight with Harry Maguire, right? But before we start that, please, I would be very helpful if you can please click the like on the video. That helps to bring in fans and bring in new ideas, and. Mm, uh, so please like that video if you like the content go and check them we have a fan friendly uh, channel so you might like it here yeah. anyway so harry magwe last week was it last week some couple of days ago there was this um, news who came out that manchester united has uh, accepted an agreement with west ham principle in principle for 30 million pounds just last just some couple of uh, just a week half one and a half week ago we know West Ham came in for 20 million bid for Harry Maguire and uh, uh, Manchester United turned it down and they went for they came in with another bid of 30 million Harry Maguire uh, um, uh, uh, it was reported that Harry Maguire will leave Manchester United but at the last minute now we're hearing much from uh, journalists that Harry Maguire is going to stay I want to tell you guys what is going on here the biggest problem which is going on uh, with Har uh, Harry Maguire leaving is not him going to a, a lesser club. We have had top players, Neymar just signed to a uh, 175 million um, euros a year contract with Saudi Arabia. It's about money. So Harry Maguire is earning, is reportedly earning roughly 150 to 190 plus minus uh, 1000 euros a week in Manchester United. And the deal with West Ham, it is reported like I'm in the window. And look, it's very sunny. Let me just go closer to you guys. Uh, so it is reported that West Ham is ready to pay him 120 thousand uh, pounds a week, none more. I think he will be one of the highest earners in West Ham if he goes to West Ham. So the situation here is Harry Maguire is not ready to lose right a region of 50 and 70 million um, thousand pounds a week uh, salary, and it is rational. It's not Harry's Maguire fault. It's Manchester United fault. It's the way the contracts are, 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 are designed. I, I keep telling you guys, if you haven't watched the video I posted here on the channel about how um, Ed Wood would destroy Manchester United with all these crazy salaries. We had a situation with, Alex, with Sanchez, with Alexis Sanchez, if you remember. We had situations with Pop Gar. We had situation. I mean, salary situations have always been an issue. It's just, if you think... Um, if you think uh, Phil Jones loved Manchester United so much that he wasn't playing and could have was ready to stay on the bench for Manchester United, that's a lie. With the modern footballer, especially the UK one, sorry guys, I know you guys have your mentality in the UK, uh, I respect your position, but I want to say this, with the UK mentality, with the UK weak mentality, which is all about making money without achieving anything, I mean, it, it, you can see Harry, Harry Maguire's rationale here. I do understand his position. I don't support it, I, and but I think he has a point. But let me tell you what I think is going to happen with Harry Maguire, right? Harry Maguire wants to play football. He doesn't want to be in the bench. The last game we played, just two days ago, the game against uh, Wolves, Maguire 
was on the bench and Lindelof came. That was a statement from the manager. Some of you don't understand the way football works, the way communication with players. When a coach, a coach will not come on the TV and say, I don't want this player, let him go. A coach will not say, I don't want, um, I mean, it's very unprofessional for coaches to say, I don't want a player or I want a player. A coach will say, it's a good player, it's a good talent, we'd love to see him here, but a coach will not go on a direct statement with players. So if you're waiting for Ten Hag to say, Harry Maguire, leave the club physically on the cameras, you're wasting your time. You don't understand the way football works, unfortunately. The way it works, it works more on action. So Ten Hag did not put <coughs> Harry Maguire in that game. <coughs> it's a statement that we need you to go. And the reason we're talking about Harry Maguire leaving is not because we don't really want him to get his salary. It's just a problem that we cannot, for us to buy with the FFP rules, for us to buy, we need to sell. Us means Manchester United. So for us to buy, we need to sell. We need to create, uh, we need to generate some income in Manchester United. Ultimately, what we need to do is to sell players. We know McTominay is uh, not on the market technically, but Ten Hag said if the right offer comes, we can give him up. The right offer for McTominay, I think, on Manchester United will be at least 40 million. He has three more year contract for Manchester United. He's an energetic midfielder. We know with Sam, uh, <clears throat> it's also interesting on McTominay. But let me just close it very quickly and tell you my position. This is what I think. I think Harry Maguire will be sold. I think Manchester, Man, Harry Maguire will not stay in Manchester United. I want to tell you guys why. I think Harry Maguire will be sold. I think uh, Scott Marti McTominay might stay only if the right offer, which is £40 million, is not placed on the table. But I can tell you guys, I think both of them will go. And let me tell you how it's going to work. West Ham is all political. West Ham is saying they are, they are, they are looking for other options on the, if my, Manchester United is not ready to take um, uh, Harry, the deal of £60 million for Harry Maguire and McTominay. And they are going for Kodos and Ajax. And West Ham have, have said, okay, you know what? We, we are going for Kodos, you know? West Ham, it takes a long time for, for clubs to really uh, to look at players, right? And I think West Ham is going at the last minute, the last week of this transfer window will be very active. I am very sure West Ham is going to buy one of, at least one of our players. And uh, it is moving closely to Harry Maguire. Yes, they won the first game against uh, uh, against Fulham. That might encourage them, but I think um, uh, the, the David Morris is a admirer of Harry Maguire. And uh, what Manchester United will have to do, will have to comp compromise. United will have to give Harry Maguire that sum of money. I mean, we're talking about uh, when I, I we're talking about five million pounds, but now it has risen to seven million pounds that Manchester United have to give Harry Maguire to let him go. Um, and catching is their fault. It's not Harry Maguire's fault. You, when you, oh, the sun is like fucking. Hell. So it is their fault. So you won't blame Harry Maguire for wanting to uh, 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 to ask for more money. So that's my position. I think Harry Maguire will be sold. So you guys put him back. I mean, come back here and tell me. You, I'll tell you guys. You tell me. Oh yeah, Ralph said Harry Maguire will be sold. I'm not panicking like all the other other. The, uh, creators here on the football channels. I'm not panicking. I know he will be sold. He'll be a last minute transfer and United will need to make a deal. These things are done behind 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 our backs. It's been reported that Harry Maguire hasn't spoke to David Moyes. Moyes. I think that's a lie. Sorry I'll call it out. I think that's a lie. I think Harry Maguire has approached Harry me approached officially from with West Ham but but it's a bit strange because you don't make a deal with a club if you haven't accepted personal terms with a player that doesn't work in football I, I work with some transfers in sports and i'm telling you guys it doesn't work so it's a bit fishy here yeah. that's why i think harry Maguire will leave so forget about that let's go to the short greenwood story i wanted to say that do it i mean give me just one two minutes Mason greenwood i said i'm wondering if we would come back and play i've had some stupid comments here i've had some idiots i have some i, I some some guys writing trying to be uh pope john the second or pope job the water trying to be jesus on this channel Football, keep religion aside. Football is for footballers. If you want to be your religion, please go to Rome and start doing your stuff. I don't want people, I, I will not say I don't want, I do, I do respect your position, but I don't understand people who want to take advantage of people's mis of others' misfortune and capitalize on it. Greenwood did a mistake. If Greenwood comes out with a video, this is my position, I've said this so many times, if Greenwood comes out with a video and asks for apology, of all football fans worldwide and Manchester United fans, I will take him with all my two hands. If you guys are very unforgiving, forgive, forgive, if you guys 
don't I mean uh, you, you forgiveness is an issue for you guys then uh, you can crack on with your life right I'm not a perfect guy neither is Greenwood so I think if we, Green, the only thing Green would have done, which I would not take him back to Mark much Center, that if he did murder someone, if there was that proof of murder, right? I might hate you. You might watch in this video and you might hate me, right? You might not like me. It doesn't mean I need to, I, I won't say hi to you, you know? So you guys, I, I am, I'm, it is becoming very absurd that most of the guys who are coming on this video about Greenwood don't, don't want to give Greenwood a, a second chance for Manchester United. Okay, you might not want to give him a second chance, but try to demonize the guy. You guys are just bitter. I have a strong feeling this, uh, this might be bitter people or just not United fans. So I don't think, uh, I'm not buying me this issue that Manchester United has to kick out Greenwood from the team. I want Greenwood in, and I think if he does an ap apology, fine. That would be perfect. If he does apology for the players, fine. But in my position, my advice would have been Greenwood to give to post a video for the fans and get the reaction. This is very important. I think United are working on that. Don't come here. I don't need to be read from David Austin to make such decision. This is my decision, and I think it's correct. So, guys, tell me what you think again about Greenwood. Tell me about Harry Maguire. Uh, your position. I've told you here on the United Way TV. Harry Maguire will be sold, and that's how it is. And I really believe that because I've spoken to some people who really. Uh, uh, sit on this position that at the end of the day there will be some kind of uh, settlement it could be with United it's a financial issue it's not like you know so I think there will be that settlement and uh, that's where we are okay guys I'm still on holiday in Portugal the next one week we will be on the studio doing our live video it will be more live than me doing this pre-record because of the weak internet we do have from time to time from one place we move to another with that all said, guys, we'll be doing our preview for our next game, Tottenham Hotspur game. So stay tuned with the United Way. Smash a like on the video. Take care. Subscribe if you want to join the channel. You're welcome by me. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.